current 777 for the MSFS kinda sucks. But that's about to change very soon. Just in a few days, the PMDG variant will finally be ready to purchase. But now let's talk about why the Captain Sim 777 has its bad fame. Welcome to the Flight and Find, and let's dive into the intriguing story of Captain Scum. First thing to talk about here is why Captain Sim planes even considered as scum. Here's the case. In MSFS there is a default 747, which has a cockpit visually similar to the 777's one. So what do the Captain Sim developers do? They acquire visual models of their planes, probably from some FSX developers, and then just replace the broken or non-existent cockpit with the default 747's one, just for the plane to be flyable. Then they tweak few settings in the FMC for it to display the wanted model and correct the fuel tank capacity. That's all they do. Next, they charge you 30 US dollars to experience this masterpiece. For example, look at this engine panel, looks similar. This is because it's from the 747-8 cockpit. Navigation display is also taken from there and there are a lot of more of such similarities. Even aerodynamics are very similar, if not the same, to the default Boeing 747. So yeah. This plane, with the price of 30 bucks, is totally not worth it. That's why everyone calls it Captain Scum. But now let's transition to some very good news. PMDG 777 will arrive to an airport near you just in a few days. It will be ready to buy from 25th to 30th of June, so get ready for it. I have already covered most of the features for the upcoming plane in this video, so if you want to know more about it, there you have it. But from March, few other features and news have been introduced. First of all, pricing information is yet to be released, but my bet that it will be from 70 to 100 US dollars. The price is high, but the quality will be very high as well. Usual thing for the PMDG planes. For that price, you will get the regular updates to the software that will keep the experience up to date. And the best thing is that you will be able to install the same airplane to the MSFS 2024 without having to buy another version. PMDG stated that the airplanes won't be included in the default FS 2024 edition, but instead everything that you bought from them will be possible to transfer. Ok, as I finished with the PMDG experience info, now let's compare Captain Scam with the PMDG 777 using their latest trailer.
PMDG, as usual, gives us the superior experience that will be updating for free for a very long time. Pay 100 bucks and you will have probably the best 777 add-on at least for the upcoming decade. With such nuances, it is understandable why the price is very high. And on that note, it's time for me to save money for it. Speaking of which, you can become a sponsor of my channel to help me buy it. Your subscription will also be very helpful. And if you want to see the detailed commentary about this 777, you can watch this video, where we take a first look on this magnificent bird. Go see it and hope you'll have a great flight on the PMDG 777.